Well, in case you didn't know, craft beer is kind of a big deal around this area. And this weekend is an international event to celebrate the art of the brew. It's Big Brew Day, and it's new in What's Brewing. And I'm joined now by Kendra Kennedy and Karen Shar from the female, from, excuse me, the powder keggers, which is part of the female fermentation, fermentation brigade. Yes. We have a lot of alliteration going on. It's a yes. little bit of a tongue twister. Mm -hmm. So what, let's start by talking about what is the powder keggers? So powder keggers is a group that uh, we've started uh, helping teach women how to brew, how to make their own wine, how to make their own cider, how to make their own mead. So we do kind of simplified recipes with, um, just equipment that you might already have around the house. Oh. So that's kind of what powder keggers is all about, kind of educating females and getting more females into the brewing scene. And there's actually a big holiday, I'm gonna say holiday, coming up yes. this weekend that's yes, going, hopefully going to pull some more people into this. It's more, I'm gonna say it's more than a hobby because really it's, it's almost a lifestyle it at is. this point is brewing. Um, and that is Big Brewers Day. It's on Saturday, the 25th anniversary, which is, Hard, hard to believe. Right. But um, what is Big Brewers Day and you know how can people get involved? So Big Brew Day was started by the American Home Brew Association. It's just a chance for brewers to get together as a group and brew. Everyone brings their own equipment and just set up and people brew. They bring beers that they have made and everyone samples it. You know, people bring food, so it's kind of like a little potluck and it's just a good time and you can see how other people brew, you know, how their systems work, so. Wow, and this is a national ho event, holiday, right? Right, uh, there's participants in all 50 states and 27 wow. countries. Oh my goodness, so international, not just national, yes. international. So how much do you guys, how much is it about learning or is it more just kind of like camaraderie? It is, I think it's a little bit of both because there's people that come, they wanna see, okay, I've been doing like maybe extract brewing. Mm -hmm. uh, what about getting into all grain? They look at people's systems and how they're set up, you know, talk to them about it and what, you know, what they would need to do. And then it is about sharing beers and food, so. What does it mean to have an event like this, an international event focused on craft beer here in the Quad Cities? It's just one of the things to just help get the word out. I mean, this is, it is a fun hobby, but it is also kind of a lifestyle. And I mean, so many home brewers here in the Quad City started as home brewers, and now they're brewing at, you know, the various uh, breweries here in the area. So it can be not only a lifestyle, but a career too, so. Yeah, a launching pad, if you will, for some of the best and the brightest in the industry. Yes. Awesome. Well, thank you guys so much for joining us and looking forward to this event on Saturday. Yes. Thank you guys so much yeah, and best of you. luck. Thanks Have fun. for having us. Stop by and see us. <laughs> Well, for all episodes brewed, new and old, check out the website at BrewedTV.com and keep up with brew, the Brew Crew on social media at BrewedTV.